Today, we're going to cover the res ipi for a retained symmetrical tonic neck reflex. Symmetrical tonic neck reflex, or STNR, is also known as the crawling reflex and can be identified in the two main ways a baby bends and flexes. First, when a baby's head moves down, its legs straighten and arms bend. The next one is just the opposite. As the baby's head moves up, you'll see the legs bend and the arms straighten. STNR starts to develop as early as six months of age and should be fully inhibited by 11 months. What are some of the symptoms of a retained STNR? You might see red flags, such as poor posture, slump sitting, ape walk, toe walking, poor coordination, difficulty sitting still and concentrating. Step one, set the intensity of the tuner to the highest level you're able to tolerate. We want to start on the side of the body that's weakest. Using a moderate amount of pressure, use the wing of the tuner to scrape your entire body, starting from your toes and moving up towards your head. Once you've finished scraping the weakest side of your body, do the same thing to the other side. We wanna give the weak side of your body twice as much attention. Let's go back and scrape it one more time. You'll wanna do this for 20 minutes every day, at least three times a week. Thanks for joining us today. Don't forget to subscribe to the Resimax YouTube channel where you can tune in to more recipes and other exciting videos. Together, we can tune out pain and tune into life.